a new trailer for the new animated movie is going to co uh, coming out uh, next year, the summer of 2016. I think, believe in, look it up, uh, May 20th. And now it's, <laughs> for which my brother, my, my, my brother saw this trailer and he saw it was, it was completely stupid, you know, because for the reason, because they, it's the trailer for the Angry Birds movie. Now, first of all, just for starters, and, and, and I'm sure I'm sure everyone knows Angry Birds is was a video is a video game that's got it got popular I like, think for the past couple of years I think it was. I think it came out like a couple of years. I can't remember when, when the first first fish like fish officially came out though, but I'm, they, it's been around for a while for like a, a year or two, no more than a year. Two, I think, like two, three years. I think it was. I can't remember. I remember. I remember when it first came out, though. But it's it's been like a few years since it's been. So it's kind of like recent, you know. But it got it got popular, you know. Has like a lot of like mods and varieties of video games of Angry Birds, you know. And for me, I've never played the Angry Angry Birds video game. I've never taken an interest in playing the Angry Birds video games. Some my kind of game at all, you know. But I know it's a very popular video game franchise, you know, and I guess so popular they wanted to make a movie of it, you know, an animated movie, you know. And and when the, they just they just came out, they, I think believe today they just came out with the first teaser of the animated movie, the Ang the Angry Birds movie, and. And I saw, and, I sh and uh, my brother saw this trailer. He thought it was completely stupid because he's like, "Oh, and he's like, Angry Birds? Wow, you know, that's completely stupid, you know." But seeing this, seeing this teaser, and now I'm kind, I'm kind of interested. I'm kind of interested in seeing this uh, animated movie. But if, even though, despite I've never played the video games, you know, although there's all the only thing, I, the only character I know. Was the course the is the main the, is the main angry bird one was the red bird which I think is red you know well it's, of course obviously he's a red bird and his name is red you know obviously he's the, he's the main angry bird character you know um, and like like it opens up you know like the character the, the main angry bird character red using his lunch you know he sees three girl birds, you know, which he assumes that they're look they're looking at him, like waving to him, winking at him, you know, which really enough they're not really looking at him, he's looking at this um other uh male bird as uh, that's sitting on a branch atop of them. He jumps down on red, you know, shoves his face in a mailbox, you know. And decent voice cast, you know. Um like a Jason uh sued Jason Sud uh Sudukis, whatever mispronounce his last name, which be of course are part of what people know for the comic films has been horrible bosses and the sequel and we're the Millers, you know. Um although I like I liked his voice role in the two thousand thirteen animated film Epic where he played um uh the the um the uh the father of the main character, you know, the human character for M MK, I think it was the word for her, I forget, yeah. MK was the, was the daughter's name in Epic, you know, and Jason Sudeikis, Sudeikis <clears throat> is to play a voice as the father, you know, the obsessed with finding the Leafman, you know. I liked his voice role in that film, you know. And he voices um Red, the main angry bird in the movie, you know. And then it shows, uh, it shows the other, character, other angry birds characters, like the one named... The, the only character I know was the was the main Angry Bird one, the red red, you know. I'm not familiar with all the other characters, you know. Like this one named Chuck, this yellow bird, you know, voiced by Josh Gad. Everyone probably remembers he voices Olaf in Frozen, you know. Which he also voiced another anime in the fourth Ice Age film, you know, as um I forget what the the hedgehog the, the hedgehog, I forget what the, his name was. Of course, his, his 
the office still the only recent role, role he was good in was voicing Frozen, you know, as Olaf. I saw him in Pixels, with Adam Sandler, did not like his character at all. So the only good performance he did with voicing was Olaf in Frozen, you know. I did not did not like his character in Pixels, you know. Um the one who's uh, so obsessed with this video game chick, you know. But he voices this yellow bird, like they think like doing exercises, you know. I forget what those moves are, but then uh, Danny Mc Danny McBride has this bird named Bomb. He says, you know, he's this bl round black bird. You know, like, well, if I get upset, I get upset, I blow up. Like, it goes to his house, and a couple of friends like surprise him, you know, like a surprise bar. Then his house blows up, which I guess you get in the case, and when he gets upset. I guess he farts really explosively. That's why I assume, you know, because it looked like a, like a, I don't know. I'm not sure if it was a fart, though, but he says he blows up, so I guess he just blows himself up like a bomb. Hence his name, you know. He says, sorry, cry foul, I guess it was, or party foul, I think it was. Either that, either that, he make, he's like, he's a, he's a upsetting bomb as way as is what he is, or... For, for the other reason, farts. Explosive farts, I guess. I don't know. But, but I can't really figure like, it It didn't sound like a fart, you know, to make the sound of one, but... Moving on. Um, and um, another voice another voice actor, Bill uh, Hader, which he recently voiced in uh, another animated film, was in Disney's Pixar's um, Inside Out. He voiced... Um, the the emotion fear I believe yeah fear and of course he's also recently starred in that show the last man if you're if you know the new um, Fox comedy comedy film show um, the last man on earth he he's the one who has that big beard you know that's Bill Hader so he voices um, uh, this character you know who's like he says he's the leader he's I'm a pig you know when he arrives on his boat into the island and is Hello, I'm a pig, you know, and the the other bird's like, what's a pig, you know? And also, like, also throughout the rest of the, <clears throat> like, for the, for the, throughout the entire trailer, well, the, not the beginning, but the, or, like, 30 seconds at the beginning, and then for the rest on, it, play, here, it plays, um, Michael Jackson's, um, bad, you know? You know, I'm bad, I'm bad, really, really bad, you know? I mean, for sure everybody lo loves Michael Jackson's songs, though, but, well, well, because they're angry and they're bad, you know, they don't seem, they don't seem bad birds, you know. Or another instance of what I mentioned in the trailer, where Red is sleeping and he hears thumping noise and there's this bird kicking a soccer ball against his house, you know, and he just looks at him and all of a sudden goes and kicks him into the sea, you know. Which I thought, okay, I thought that was kind of funny, though, but, you know, he just looks at him. Like the, the little bird with his eyebrows like this, and then Red does the same thing back with a smile and goes and kicks him, you know. But I forgot to mention that part. Um, yeah, and then the pigs, you know, like the pig like, roll out like this wooden escalator, but then he ends up going back. He's like, oh, you're not doing this right, you know. They'll tell him to do this other pig, and he's like, okay, I'm coming back down again, and then shows the title, you know. And then, then shows Red, you know, walking. There's this. Okay, that's like, like I say, why this is a, this uh, sign, this movement sign with this annoying laugh, you know, like, ha, 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 or whatever it was, ha, 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 like that, you know. He's like, he's starting to get angry, you know, he's like, curling up his fist, you know, and he's about to lose it, but then he get like, calms himself down, and he proceeds to walk, and he shoves the, he shoves the, the sign, but it, hit, it hits him back, and then calms himself down again, and as soon as he walks up, of course, I know, I, I knew he would do that, you know. As soon as he walks off, of course, we know he's going to come back and jump on the on the sign, you know, and wreck it. So, yeah. So, the Angry Birds movie, like I said, I've never, I've never played the video games, you know. Now, I was never too familiar with the Angry Birds, but I know everywhere I heard the Angry Birds, you hear it is the main Angry Bird character, Red, you know. So. But... But uh, even though I've never played the video games, you know, I never have found no interest though. And um, but seeing but seeing that they make it make a movie of it, and seeing the first um, new uh, teaser for it, you know, 
I'll get I'll give it a shot, you know. But like I said, there's there's a few animated films I that I don't watch though, because like like the Despicable Me franchise never grew attached to that franchise, you know. And I know Minions now made over a billion dollars, you know. It's made more than especially made more than the number two, you know, Despicable Me too, you know. I just never found no. I just never find, just never cared to see minions, you know. I know sure everybody, a lot, of, a lot of people like the min, the characters of minions, but I never care for the characters of the minions, you know, how the way they talked or anything like that. Although I did like Sandra Bullock's voice as um, Scarlet Overkill, you know, because because I like Sandra Bullock as an actress, you know. So that was probably the only thing worth. If I saw the, if I saw minions, that was probably the only, the only thing worth watching was um, Sandra Bullock's voice in it, you know. But yeah, I just never, I just never got interested in, interest in the Despicable Me franchise, you know. But the Angry Birds movie, I give it a shot, you know. Even hey, my brother, I don't think he wants. Every, after he saw the trailer, I don't think he wouldn't want to see it because oh, it's Angry Birds. I can't believe they made a a, a movie of Angry Birds, you know. Well, that's just that's just him though. But for me, I give it a shot, so I'll look forward to seeing it. I think it was looking up. Yeah, it's May 20th, 2016, next year in the summer, you know. And looking up the, for the budget already, it's like, like 80 million. I look, I look at the, I look at the film and stuff. I'm like, really? This film costs 80 million? So, I'm sure it probably won't be a flop though, because you know the popularity of the, of the video games. Everybody's playing it, you know. And probably look forward to seeing it, you know. But yeah, but anyway, that's my um, review. My thoughts of my on the trailer on uh, the first uh, trailer for the Angry Birds movie. Thanks for watching and stay tuned on the next um, movie review and or whatever later.